what we're going to see next is a verification of the winding of the watch. At the moment, the chain is entirely wound around the barrel of the watch, which is right next to my finger. The fusee, which is responsible for the constant force with its different diameters, is over here. Think of this like a bicycle derailleur. When the barrel is fully wound, it's in going to be in high gear. And as the barrel unwinds, it goes to successively lower gears to keep the force constant. So as you can see now, the uh, chain is going to move from the larger diameters, which is to say the low gears, when the barrel is unwound and it climbs up to the smaller diameter portion when the barrel is fully wound, which is to say the uh, high gear, just like a bicycle derailleur. Now one thing that Breguet has done to protect the very fine chain, there is a blocking mechanism that has been incorporated into the fusee to ensure that the watch is never overwound so that the owner might risk breaking the chain. It's protected when it hits the lock. Mm -hmm.